thanks so much all of you for coming out and for visiting me up in my archery range because it was really fabulous that you guys could all recover after lunch from this uh, last ceremony and that you're ready to go again tonight because tonight it's going to be another very potent ceremony. We probably won't get a thunderstorm at 10 o'clock, but we'll, I'm sure we'll find some sort of extra drama for you. But yesterday, a lot of you were asking about why the results you got from your last visit to Refugio de Plano were so much more effective than the therapy and the counseling that you've been through for the last few decades. And that's a very, very crucial question. And it comes down to the basis of shamanic healing. Shamanic healing is very different from normal run-of-the-mill occidental healing. And I don't mean to depreciate occidental healing, believe me. I trust it and I use it all the time. However, shamanic healing goes extremely deep into the psyche. It goes extremely deep into the physical body, into the neurological system. And it can heal diseases that have not even come to the forefront yet. And it can heal diseases that, the diseases that have never been diagnosed. And that's what we're dealing with in, very often in the modern condition. People will very often complain that they have a, overlay of feeling uncomfortable, feeling off sync, and not having the proper coordinates to be able to get up smiling in the morning and go out and enjoy their work, enjoy their relationships, make new ones, make decisions, and continue forward with a joyful life that they've always aspired to. And then after coming for two weeks of shamanic therapy, ayahuasca ceremonies here, life here in the rainforest and amongst gentle people who have their best interests at heart and have no ax to grind but are simply presenting the medicine and letting it work under the surface. They go away and feel enormous benefits that they can't quite put their finger on. Now that's what drew me originally to shamanic healing and that's what keeps me going and performing and working and learning and becoming better and better at letting the medicine do its work, letting the things come to the surface, marginalizing the dysfunctional ones, and bringing the superlative assets to their culmination and being able to let people condition and develop themselves at the very highest possible frequency that's available to them in their personal and their professional lives. And a lot of you that are return clients are our prophets and, and your exponents of this because you've experienced it. Now, if you don't experience it, it's extremely hard to understand and to believe in it because it's extremely hard to believe that people can actually do something that they don't even pay attention to that's 100% under the surface and that it heals them on a broad basis. But that's precisely what they've been missing throughout all of their healing efforts. They've concentrated on one detail after another after another, taking seminars, taking therapies, taking workshops, but have always slipped back into the same malady that they originally were complaining about. In other words, the basis of the problem or the basis of the imbalance hadn't been dealt with because the thing that they were working with was too superficial. It was dancing over the surface, and it was not going deep down to where you were all last night, where a lot of you were going through enormous processing. Some of you were very idyllically happy. Some of you were crying, and then you were feeling better. You were feeling strong, and then you were feeling weak. The medicine was going through you. It was bringing out things. It was working quickly, like a laser beam, like a surgeon that works very fast without using a scalpel. Pulls things sideways, gets rid of them, pulls over things to the center, and lets them grow. Way down below the surface of your conscious mind's capacity to understand it. But since you believe in this, and since you are here and you're experiencing it, and you're able to let it do its work, in spite of the fact that you complain, my rational mind gets in the way, that's the struggle we all have. It's not a problem. The medicine is much stronger than that, 
and goes beyond it and accomplishes the healing in spite of our ability and our often tenacious necessity to get in its way. The ayahuasca medicine and the shamanic therapy will still get underneath and it will go through and the benefits will come through in the long run. Now that's what all of you are experiencing today as I see your bright faces and your bright eyes and your expectant looks about what we're going to do tonight and then the next 10 days as we're working together. And I can promise you that the medicine and the ayahuasca therapy and the shamanic therapy that we, that we are going to be doing in the next couple weeks together is going to be extremely effective. It's going to have long-term, strong results that stay with you, that are not going to let you go, and they're not going to send you back to the therapist or the pharmacy to take care of symptoms. They're going to liberate you from the dependence on things that are superficial and dysfunctional because they're going to bring you right back to the core of your existence, right back to the core of your imbalances and your problems. And they're going to bring you directly to the solution because that's exactly where they're focused. Now I'm really, really honored and pleased to have all of you here. Some of you are close friends from before. Some of you are new friends that have become very, very admirable to me in a short time. So thank you so much for your presence here by my side. And thank you also for enjoying my refugio because I love it here. I live here. I work here. And it's very much a nutritional, beautiful place to spend some time and to recharge your batteries and to readjust any imbalance you may have picked up and also to develop your creativity and your future plans in the best possible frequency that you can imagine. So thanks for your company. I'll see you in a few hours up at the ceremonial house. And if you want to come down here again tomorrow, I'll be here again uh, doing some training because this is a beautiful microclimate and you're going to learn to love it. It's right up on a hill. The air is extremely fresh and the breeze and the light is perfect for training, for doing yoga, for also doing martial arts and for doing archery practice. And that's what we do up here because it's, it's sort of like an invigorating microclimate right in the middle of the rainforest. So thanks again for coming. I'll see you in a few hours and we'll do another ceremony tonight.